Welcome to Hands on Science, where if you ever just need something to do, this is the place to be. This is Car. Oops, Car's not here today. She's on the road at Kansas. So I guess it's just me, just me today. Okay, so today we are going to be making salt painting. And this is here. This is my name, Mel. It's not quite dry yet, so I'm not going to lift it up. But if you can see, there's salt and some coloring on it. So let's go ahead and move this on the side and let us begin. Okay, so here's some paper. I got cardstock color paper. You can paper you can definitely use white paper is fine, but I chose to use a really bright color today. So all you need is some glue and choose a design. And with the glue, you're going to go ahead and make a design. So let's just make something simple today. I'm going to make some loops. And some lines. Something simple. Since I already made my name. Once you're done, make sure you have a tray. I have a tray right here. Any kind of tray is fine as long as you can catch the salt. Because we don't want the salt all over the place. So, I put some salt. This is just regular salt table salt. You can definitely use uh, the rock salt. That's fine too. But I just chose regular table salt. So you're just going to grab a bunch and I like to scoop it and just kind of pour it all over the glue. Be very generous because you want the salt to take onto the glue. Go ahead and just sprinkle it. And Okay, and once you think you've got glue, uh, salt all over the glue, you can go ahead and kind of shake it around, tap it very gently because the glue is still wet. Shake it around, make sure there's salt all over. And then just tap it so that the salt comes off, the excess salt. Okay, once you're done, you think all the salt's all there, it's on. It's all taken off. Now we can go ahead and color it. So I made two colors here. I made blue. This is just food coloring with water. And I made yellow. You can definitely just use one, but I decided to use two colors. So go ahead and use a pipette and squeeze some of this colored water and kind of just drop it here and there. If you want it only blue, you can go ahead and just put blue all over. But I'm just going to put a couple of droplets of blue. You see how it spreads? So you don't need a lot. You just need just a little squeeze. Then, since I have yellow, let's go ahead and put some yellow. Again, just take a couple of drops. You can also put it on the blue too. Blue and yellow makes green. You can definitely keep some white spots too. Alright. Isn't that cool? I think I did some good work here today all by myself. There we go. Look at that. Look at my salt painting. That's so pretty. I'm so proud of myself. Well. That's what I think about my salt painting. What do you think? Leave a comment with your thoughts to MidnightScienceClub.com. We'd also like to hear your suggestions and ideas. And who knows, maybe we'll do it right here on the To Do Show. Thank you so much for watching us on Hands On Science. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. You can find this activity and so much more at MidnightScienceClub.com. We'll see you next time right here where we're always looking for something to do. Bye.